We're here outside Vashavik Yastiveri in Østevoll in Norway. We're going to stay here for two days with a group of people and we're going to be shown around this place. We're going to a lot of locations, we're going to have delicious food and we're going to stay at this beautiful, beautiful place. We just checked into our room and we got room number two by the harbour. Over there is the reception and the restaurant and everything and in this house, in this building, we're going to stay. Our room is here, so yeah, let's go and check it out. What did you think of the room? I'm gonna show you a few more things. We have the bathroom. It's uh, kind of old fashioned, but it's really cool. You can see these woods over here, those details. They have really good products. And I love gold details, you know, gold here, gold here. Yeah. So, so also, does that, mean, does that mean we should get a golden toilet brush? Yeah. We also have a small kitchen area here with a fridge and a microwave and a Nespresso machine and the master bedroom. Here we're gonna sleep tonight. <sighs> oh, it's so soft. Yeah, I think we're gonna get a good night's sleep tonight. Good night. I'm gonna take a nap. Uh, actually, you can see the ferry, I think, or some kind of boat from our hotel room. It's pretty cool. I've actually never been to this place before, so I'm very excited to see what it has to offer. According to the plan, we're going to eat dinner, three courses, and tomorrow five courses, and a lot of activity. Can't wait to show you guys, and I can't wait to experience it. We're trying to find some food shot, food shoot spots. Yeah, we're so, going to a, a garden. It's so beautiful. So, how was the food and everything so far? I'm so full, I can't even move. <laughs> yeah. So we need to roll home then. Yeah. Rolling, <laughs> rolling. So yeah, we're gonna you know use this location to take some nice picture and everything. That was it for today. We kind of, you know, went around, scout the area, tried some test shot, and you know, just enjoy the location at all. Yeah, and we had some amazing food, and I'm so full, and yeah. Now we're just transferring all the images and videos and everything, so we have everything backed up, and then we're going to sleep because tomorrow is going to be a long and exciting day. We overslept, even though both of us put an alarm. I have no idea how, we never <laughs> oversleep. We were, oh, I'm so embarrassed. We were, we were supposed to kind of wake up, you know, catch this sunrise, but then we overslept basically. And then we like, you know, I, I woke up by someone suddenly, you know, just knocking on the door, like, you know, rushing up and opening door. And there was no one and then someone else knocked on the door again. There were some locals who were gonna, you know, they're gonna show us around and uh, take us on a hike. And we were supposed to meet like uh, 6.30. And at 6.45, uh, we wake up from uh, the knocking from the, on a door. Oh, well, at least we made it kind of in time. So, 
now we're gonna walk up Kongskleiva, which is a mountain here. They have staircase all the way up here in stones and a lot of locals have contributed, both businesses and private people. And they actually have marked certain people's name in, inside some of the stones, so that's pretty cool. Let's show you guys. Now we're at the top of Kongskleiva and with this stunning, stunning view. Just ascended from the mountain. Now we're back to the crew in the car. Yeah. Me, rice potato. We're here. Yeah. yeah, we'll be put on your Instagram and everything. So remember to follow, guys. which is uh, the mountain Lodo and we're going to a new cabin that's been built for the sake of the hike. The name of the cabin is Odlesi and yeah so it's 2.3 kilometers. Ah it's okay. Yeah but it's, uh, it's up so I don't know how long it's gonna take. <laughs> Let's see. We're finally here guys, the cabin or the area is over there, it's so beautiful. have an eagle here yeah I, th I think every time we fly the drone the eagle is coming so I'm a bit afraid that he's gonna take the drone but also we want a shot of it but we want the shot of the, of the <laughs> eagle this is risky business so this is risky business you should definitely fly the drone back yeah if I don't want to lose all the photos you know we're now ready for some burger, pizza and salad here at Smakeria in Vesavik in Östervold. The sun is shining, it's warm, it's nice and we're just gonna enjoy our life here for a moment. This is the perfect spot for a lunch in the sun. And by the way, we got our drink. This is an iced tea and it's a local one. So it's called like Grandma's Garden Berries. And uh, yeah, let's try it out. Mm, that is so yummy. It kind of tastes like childhood for me. I don't know why, but yeah. We are now at the botanical garden of Bashevik guest house. Why? Because Potato wanted to take some photo, of course, and I wanted to take some good videos, and this is the perfect place, and also the perfect season, because we have cherry blossom. And I actually bought some flowers as well at the local flower shop. Finally here now, the main course, five dinner courses, scallops, macaroni and asparagus, 
fresh fish from the bay and wheels. And we can pick our own dessert from, you know, a cream cheese with vanilla or cheese platter. I actually can't wait to eat and uh, yeah, we might have to roll back home. You might wonder where I am now. I'm in this uh, cramped small electric car. It's, uh, it's I, don't know, I don't know, it's very small. <laughs> so, you ready? Yeah. What do you feel about this car so far? It's so much fun! It's like driving a go-kart, <laughs> but it's like on the roads. <laughs> so these cars you can actually rent at Bachavi uh, Gastillery. Uh, so if you take the ferry from, for example, Bergen, which is very common, you can just like take the boat there, don't worry about a car or rental car, and then you can rent these at the, the guest house and have a lovely time to explore this amazing island. After searching around, we're finally here. Globan, or in English, the globe. It's actually straight over there, so we have to you know, walk past this area. I think it's like they built a pathway, so let's go. 